what's up now? So we got whack 100 stank ass. Took his ass to Memphis, people. In his Mercedes G way. Going to see or uh, get the fade with Memphis Stan G. You know Stan G, Mr. Old Man. You know what I'm saying? Getting to these meat and potatoes. You know what I'm talking about? Um, see the issue with that, people. When WAC 100 pulls up to Mr. Stan G. Crib, now I'm assuming that the lady that was videotaping your boy WAC 100 while he was showing their address and things of that nature, you know, personal information, people, God, don't show the whole world. And I'm assuming that's his girlfriend, but it's like, damn, so she's telling what? Why you, you know what I'm saying? Why you pulling up and you, you know what I'm saying? You showing our address and that, this and that. So make a long story short, people. After that viral video, then we have Stan G's viral video. Mr. Old Man, you know what I'm talking about? Then he's in the car with his lady friend or his woman or whatever have you people, and they're looking. They're on live, and they're looking for WAC 100. First of all, what the hell is WAC 100 doing in Memphis? Message, what? the hell is Wack 100 doing in Memphis? Well, we know why he was in Memphis. He's looking for the fade with Stan G. Now, it's looking like this was nighttime. So, I give it to Wack 100. Now, Wack 100 said he was in the car by himself or whatever the case may be, which I don't really truly believe that because I ain't rolling nowhere by myself and I'm talking about throwing a fade with somebody. Like, come on, man. First of all, y'all too damn old to be fighting. Um... I didn't even think people fought anymore. I just thought people got the bang, bang, pow, pow, and shooting your ass up. That's what I thought. Uh, well, I know that's what it is where I'm at. That, that's what people do. Ain't nobody fighting. I ain't seen nobody fighting. I don't know how long. Um, so, yeah. So, 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 that's the issue. All this taping going live when you about to do a crime. <laughs> First of all, that's got to stop. All right, that's got the dog gonna be stopped. Now, some people say this is for publicity. It's fake. It's to get their views up and whatnot. But I tell you one thing. I don't think this was fake at all. Now, they had some type of altercation disagreement take on Clubhouse. All right? And it went up from there. You know what I'm saying? So, he didn't actually say, I'll pull up on you. So, a lot of people, now, I give it to Wack 100. A lot of people will say, I'll pull up on you. Give me the address. I don't know that's, if that's how it went, but I know he pulled up to that address. It could have went bad for either one of them guys. Now, understand this. It could have went bad for any of those guys. You know, it could have been children in that house. It, it might have been, you know what I'm saying? Anything of that nature, people, don't nobody, you know, little children don't need to see all this ridiculousness from adults at night. Where is Wack 100 from? Cali or something? You all the way in Memphis. <laughs> this was personal. I ain't, I don't think this was a business trip. This was strictly personal. I don't think he was doing business there. And then he said, I'm going to slide by his crib. Nah, I think this was straight, strictly personal. So have you guys heard about this? Leave your comments in the commentaries. Um, you know, Stan G, you know, he, he, he went looking for him. So I can't say either one of these guys are punks. But is that, that's not the point. The point is, you pull up to somebody's house, they could have sent you to smithereens, uh, Wack 100. God, dog, you ain't learned nothing yet about Memphis. Huh? About Memphis? So, yeah, like, if, uh, I tell you one thing. If Stan G, I don't know if he was at home at the time, but if Stan G was around, had the right people around him at that time, hey, man, Wack 100 probably could have got seriously hurt. You feel me? I'm just saying. Or, if WAC 100 was on some demon time, your boy Stan G could have got seriously hurt. You feel me? So, it could go either way. You know what I mean? Because at this point, you come into a person's house, you come to my house, you trying to call me out, huh? And you come to my house for real, like talking and saying, yeah, pull up then, I'll give you the address. But when you pull up, though, and you really pulled up, hey, man, it, hey, it's fair game. I'm, hey, man. I don't trust your ass no more. You straight came to my crib, then you showing my address and shit. Hey, man, it is what it is on that. All right? Now, you're going to get your issue when you're fucking with me. All right? But anyway, people, y'all get in the comments. Let me know how y'all feel about this. Adults. Whack 100 and Memphis Stan G, Mr. Old Man, 
You know what I'm saying? I think Stag even got his nigga wake up call. He said, hey man, I better slow down on, you know what I'm saying, giving people my motherfucking address because this fool just, out of all people, whack 100. So you know, if whack 100 will pull up on you. Y'all better be careful on who y'all be trying to be like, well, pull up. I don't care. You know what I'm saying? One of these days, the wrong person's going to pull up, people. And somebody ain't going to be pulling away. All right? Message.